Hi there. We're continuing our journey through the Proverbs, the Mishle Shlomo, the life sayings of Solomon. We're in chapter 19, we're looking at verses 8 and 9. Verse 8 says in the original Hebrew, which is really commending the benefits of having wisdom. It says the possessor of good sense, the word in Hebrew is lev, the possessor of heart, the possessor of good, the possessor of good sense, ohev nafsho, loves his being, his in love and life. To, to not love good sense, to, to chase after foolishness, is actually to not live to the full the lives that we're given. And Shomel Tevuna, the keeper of discernment, the maintainer of insight, finds what is good. This is obviously a pointer to us to say that when we, when we pursue these things, discernment, we're actually pursuing what is good. The next verse, verse 9, is actually almost word for word the same as for chapter 19 and verse 5. And it says, Et shekarim lo yinake v'yafiach kuzavim, and then the last word, yoved, uh, whereas the, the verse 5 has yamalet, which means shall not escape. But what this basically means is that the false witness will not be um, innocentized, will not be excused, will not be pardoned, will not be led off. Uh, and the one who speaks out lies will will perish. Yoved means will perish. Again, it's repeating the same thing. It said a few verses earlier, just to remind us that when we lie, when we tell falsehoods, we set ourselves up against God. So God has no choice but to act against us because God maintains truth. God maintains order. God maintains is keeping chaos back. So when we when we pursue falsehood, when we indulge in falsehood, we're inviting God to really to, to, to act against us because God cannot do other than stand for truth. Have a good day.